hey, hey, hey. I see some people's already healed <laughs> before I start going live. Hey, hey, hey. I see Sherry, Kristen, Jason. Um, he was here first thing. He was ready. <laughs> okay. Probably nobody probably don't get the notification. Um, because you two haven't been sending out notifications lately, so I don't know. Okay, let me see. Um yeah. Oh, okay. I see Jaden. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Hey, hey, hey. Okay. Oh, I see some of everybody now. Um, what South City? What was that? Oh, oh, hey, Capri. Oh, I was just gonna say Kayla because I might mess that name up. Uh, Kayla. Oh, Laureen. Ready for the world, Amanda. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> okay, you having me laughing, girl. Look, I'm gonna mess that up. I said I would say a Kayla. <laughs> Angel, uh, Ryan verse. Hey, how you doing? Okay, so I'm not gonna be up here long because I need to get some rest. I gotta wake up early in the morning. Um, Tamika, Tierra, Lucy, Peggy. Jaleesa, is that you? You found the way a different way to spell it. If that, that it may, or maybe I'm just pronouncing it wrong. Beautiful, <laughs> Jess. <laughs> okay, so what I'm going to discuss, I said I was going to be using paper coupon. Look at this. Hey, 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 <laughs> I'm here. Hey, hey. <laughs> oh, Paula. Yeah, so uh, I'm going to discuss real quick. Oh, uh, my deals that I'm going to do with paper coupons at Dollar General, just to give you some idea, just in case you have some of these paper coupons. We're going to discuss that real quick. We're going to see, can we keep this 30 minutes tops? Okay. Yes. 30 minutes tops because I have to get some rest. We, I got to get up early in the morning so I can be able to do my video. So I want to show you what I'm going to do for, uh, just the beautiful. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Hey, Miss Oh, Miss Oh, Kiki. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to get started. I know, I know. Maybe I could come back on Saturday. We're going to cut the food Saturday, but we're going to have to get it going today. So we're going to go ahead and do a screen share. I want to show you what I'm planning on doing at Dollar General tomorrow. Hopefully, my store will still have everything, the store that I went to. Hey, Chase. Tracy, Lord Jesus, look at that. I can't talk worth nothing. <laughs> I can't talk worth nothing. Oh, let me see. Hey, Protessa, I do enjoy your video. Thank you. I, I can't talk worth nothing. So let me see how I'm going to do this screen. Share real quick, and we're going to go ahead, and I'm going to discuss the deal that I'm going to do on, hold on. Let me see, make sure, because see, I, I mess the simplest things up sometimes. Yes, I do. I think I got it. There we go. Y'all tell me if y'all see. Okay, I think y'all see it. Okay. Okay, I've been selling penny stuff. Oh, hey, Miss West. I've been selling. Hold on. I want to get back on the screen. Okay. I've been selling penny stuff and coupon stuff at the flea market tomorrow till one. Oh, Okay. If y'all know where Sherry um flea market is at, she's selling the penny stuff and stuff. She get her money. Girl, I ain't messing with you. Get that money. Okay. So this is what I'm planning on doing. This is one of the deals I'm planning on doing um tomorrow. So this is the first deal. Then I'm gonna show you like the uh pictures of the coupons. Okay. Okay, let me see. Hold on, let me see what Miss Oh. Uh, Okay, I'm going to get also. I won't be in your business. Kiki, <laughs> go talk to Brill. <laughs> I can't with you today. Okay, let me go ahead and get back over here. Okay, so let's get started. So I want to get a um Dove Men Body Watch, which is $4.50. I'm also going to get a women's body watch, which is six dollars. I want to get the bio free pouches, which is a dollar and seventy-five cent. I want to get three of the pantines, which is $4.50. I want to get the Elwit 2, which is $3.25. I want to get um two swab deodorants. Now, the reason why I'm getting two swab deodorants is because I need 
deodorant okay i don't know what my kid's doing with the deodorant i don't know if they eat it i don't know what happened but it keep disappearing so i'm going to get two swab deodorants which is um two dollars i'm going to get the um three of the folgers to go coffee which is going to equal up to three dollars okay the coupons that i'm going to use i'm going to use about five off of 25 my two dollars off for the dove men's body wash that coupon can in the unilever booklet I want to use the two dollars off two off of seven for the Dove products. I want to use the dollar off for the Dove body wash. I want to use the two dollars off for the BioFreeze products. I want to use that four off of three for the Pantene. I want to use the three dollars off for the Febreze or or two. We have a dollar off for the Folgers to go coffee, and we also have a dollar off of two for the Folgers to go. So that equal up to four dollars for twelve items, making each item only thirty three cent. Okay, so I feel like that's a good deal. That's my first deal that I'm planning on doing. And hold on, let me stop the screen so I can kind of show you the coupons. Okay, so I want to see can I do this again so I can show you the coupons so you can kind of have a visual of how the coupons look. Okay, let me see the gallery. Okay, so hopefully, I think this is the one. Yes, this is the one. So hopefully you can see that. So you can kind of have a visual. We got our five off of 25, our two off of seven, $2 for the um, Dove Men. Then we have the dollar off for the Dove Body Wash. I have a $2 off for the BioFreeze, the four off of three for the Pantene, $3 for the Febreze or two, the dollar off of two for the um, Folgers, and then we have a dollar off for the Folgers, okay? So that's for our first deal, all right? And all the coupons are scanning, all the coupons are attaching, okay? So we shouldn't have no issues. That two off of... Hold on, what it was, two off of eight for the Dove Instant Saving. That's still not popping up, so I'm not going to test it. I'm not going to even work with it, okay? I'm, I'm okay with paying $4 for everything I got here, okay? So then I'm also going to do a second deal. Give me a second so I can show you. Hey, chocolate drop. Okay, awesome deal. Oh, yeah, I feel like it's an awesome deal too. Okay, see, I wasn't going to Dollar General tomorrow, but here you go with the dough. Look, I need some dove body wash <laughs> and I got to get some deodorant for the kids. So I said, I might as well do a whole scenario. You know what I'm saying? Instead of me just going to the store and getting those few items, it might well for me to do a whole scenario. Okay, so I want to show you the second deal that I'm planning on doing tomorrow also. So let me show you that. Give me one more second. Okay. And I'll show you the second deal. Okay. So this is the second deal that um I plan on doing. Okay. So this one again, I'm getting the um uh, this time I'm just getting the dove women body wash, okay, because I need that myself. Okay, and we'll also get a dove deodorant because I wanted to put a deodorant in this scenario because I don't know what my kid is doing with the deodorant. <laughs> I got a uh, Folger coffee, just one. I got the BioFreeze um pouches, um, which is a dollar seventy-five cent. I got the Febreze or two, which is three twenty-five. I got the Elwick or uh, Orchid because those sell in bundles great. If you sell bundles, um, they sell great. Okay, what about some game deals? Okay, to me, all digital, because the main thing I run into when I do game deals is that people say they don't have the paper coupon for the game or they don't get that coupon in that area. To me, the out-of-pocket is not um, up to my standards, okay? But uh, I did came up with a game deal, but I think the out-of-pocket was going to be like maybe $13, which I said $13 is just for the pods. You, if you could get detergent and all that, you know, with it, I feel like it's still a decent deal. But we have gotten gain lower than that, so I had got stocked up on the gain when I did the clearance sale. <laughs> when I, I, yeah, I had got stocked up. But um, if y'all would still want me to put some gain deals together, I could put some gain deals together. It's just that the issue is going to be a lot of people going to say they don't have the paper, the paper coupons. Okay, so that's why I didn't really put no game deals together. Okay, so, but next week, 
I will put some game deals together. I see kind of put some together that's all digital, and I will put some together that with the paper coupons because I, I have the paper coupons for the game. Hey, Maxine. Okay. Watch the live. We get a five off of 20. That's what I said, too. We need a five off of 20 because I feel like, you know, we have gotten game for way cheaper then I, I tried to put a game deal together when I put my scenarios together. And I was like, I'm just not feeling this total. <laughs> I'm like, I'm just not really when I'm, if I was out, if I was out of game, like I, if I didn't hardly have no game, then I would do it. But the fact that I don't need it, <laughs> like I don't need it. It's like, I can't justify spending almost $15 unless it was like, I would get a $5 on um, PG coupon at the receipt. At the bottom of your receipt, then I can say, okay, I spend, you know, who needs gain? Hold on. Okay, who needs gain coupons? I got them on that. Well, beautiful Jess said that she got the gain coupons on that. <laughs> so that's what she said. She said she got them on that. Okay. Hey, Andrea. Okay. Hey, Renee. Okay, so. Hold on, I forgot where I was at. Okay, so I'm going to grab the Airway or 2 because they sell great in bundles. I'm going to grab three of the Pantene and I'm going to grab the Tide Step with detergent. All that equal up to $25.20. I'm going to use my five off of $25, the two off of seven for the Dove, the dollar off for the Dove body wash, the dollar off for the Folgers on coffee, the two dollars off for the Biofreeze, the three dollars off for the Oil Wick on Oil Twos, the dollar and fifty for the Air Wick kit. The four off of three for the Pantene and a dollar off for the gain. I mean, not the gain, <laughs> but the tad simple. Okay, that coupon also go for the gain detergent. Okay, so uh, after all the coupons, my total is supposed to be four dollars and seventy cent for those two, ten items. So those are the deals that I'm planning on doing. <laughs> Let me stop this so I can at least show you the coupons to that real quick. So hold on, give me a second, and then I see if I can show you the coupons to that. Okay. Yeah, so those are the deals that I'm pretty much planning on doing. Um, okay, I was so sad in May when they gave us the five off of 30. I said the same thing because I, I would need that five off of 20. That's a great deal, short mama. I just can't go on um, to the Dollar General in the hood. Look. Your Dollar General is pitiful. Your Dollar General had me in a depressed state. <laughs> I said, Lord Jesus, she can't do nothing in that Dollar General. I don't like that one. <laughs> I said, Lord Jesus, everybody shot Bill. <laughs> okay, so here is the coupons that you will be using for the second deal you use your five off of 25 your two off of seven your dollar off this dollar off coupon also go for the tie step of the turkey it says it in the fine print um your dollar off for the dove your two dollars off for the buy freeze four off of three for the pantene three dollars off for the febreze or two dollar and fifty for the airwick and we're going to use the dollar off for the folgers so i feel like that is also a good deal um and that's pretty much the two deals that I'm planning on doing. I'm not even going to Family Dollars. I'm going to start doing some more um, Family Dollars deals, though. Okay, have anyone at Family Dollars um, to see if it's worth doing tomorrow? I'm not going to Family Dollars because, to me, Family Dollars don't give you enough digitals. But let me point you to somebody that posted a lot of Family Dollars um, deals. Uh, I think you got to get the two pays and stuff like that to get your out-of-pocket low. And I'm just not feeling getting more toothpaste right now. I'm not feeling to get a toothpaste. I just not. But hold on. Let me point you to someone that is doing a lot of Dollar General videos. Not Dollar General. She ain't doing Dollar General videos. She's doing um family dollar deals. Okay. She is doing so fam this is a good deal. Okay. If y'all say y'all looking for game, y'all get gotta get the pods though. Okay, so this is Natalie Say. Okay. She did a game deal with the pods. I prefer the liquid. Uh, I get the pods for my kids, though. But she did, and her Instagram name. Oh, let me show you her Instagram name. So someone type it in the chat for me uh, if you see it. This is her Instagram name. She don't. She used to do videos, but she no longer really do videos. But she posts uh, consistently on Instagram. 
So if you see right here, she got a whole lot of um five off of 25 for family dollars. So she got a game deal for family dollars. She got this deal right here. Maybe I might go. I might go. Oh, um, thank you. Thank you, Miss West. Yeah, she got a um nice decent um deal for the tab pods. She got a lot of deals. So go up there, screenshot, you know, just to have something to go back. For everybody that wants family dollars, he has a, she she had posted a whole lot of family dollar scenarios. So go check out her. Um, okay, thank you. You're welcome. Okay, hey, short mama, glad you shouted out Natalie. Oh, you welcome. Yeah, of course. I always give prompts where prompts is due. You know, ooh, this is a real good deal that she got right here, and this was going to be five dollars and eighty cents. Now this is a deal that I would do myself. She got right here. Um, a tad, a tad, hold on, I'll read it out to you, then I'll show you again. She got a tad detergent, which is $4.95, a tad pot, which is $4.95, a tad simple detergent, which is, um, hold on, $2.95, a tad simple pot, which is $2.95, she got a game dish detergent, which is $2, and she got two Febreze, um, or twos. Now I don't know if I need to get three or two because she got the five off of oh no, she got she got two. Okay. So she got two Febreze or twos and a big razor. And all of the after all the coupons go equal up to five dollars and eighty cents. Okay, hold on, let me read that real quick. And then I show you um show you this deal right here because I might do this deal myself. Okay. Okay, my dollar general had the gain. Gain scented bees on clearance, then 75%. Oh, I got a bunch. Dec I could not find the decorative boxes. I was in my whole feelings. I could not find no boxes nowhere. Okay. Okay. Great. Great hole. All my makeup. Yeah. I, I wanted those boxes and I couldn't find them nowhere. Okay. Now I need to get a Instagram account. Girl, <laughs> Renee, you should have been at an Instagram account. <laughs> That's where people post all the deals at. Okay, this is the deal. I might actually, the only thing about my um family dollar is that it opens so late. It don't open at 8 o'clock. It opens like at 9 and I got to be at work by then. So that's why it's hard for me to do family dollars on Saturday. But this is the deal. I might actually do this deal and just give her a shout out. That's what I'm going to do. I think I might actually, if my store held the uh, or um twos i might actually do this deal and just give her a shout out in my video and make sure everybody know where this deal came from <laughs> but this might be the deal that i might actually do if i do go to um family dollars but yeah that's a great deal that that is a deep that is a very decent deal right there because my store don't allow me to record so what i might have to do is do a sneak record <laughs> and do this deal and, and yeah, my I might have to do a sneak record. Didn't can everybody see the deal, or is everybody able to screenshot the deal? And again, this came from Natalie. So if y'all able to screenshot the deal or see the deal, or just go to her page and and and, and go to her page. <laughs> do sneak record and be funny, yes, yeah, because I be fast. <laughs> Knowing I was supposed to be recording in the store, and I be running so fast, I be like this. My feet be pitter patter. I be like, <laughs> okay, I screenshot it. Okay, that's good. So you screenshot it. Okay, I be pitter pattering. I have, I be pitter. I be like... <laughs> trying to hurry up before she catch me. <laughs> so those are the deals. Like I said, I gotta check my account and see if I got all those coupons that she mentioned in that um. Family dollar deal, because that's the only deal I might actually do. <laughs> she has some bomb deals. Yes, she do. I right, so I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to get that deal and I'm gonna just give her a shout out. I'm gonna let y'all know this is not my deal. <laughs> this is not my deal. <laughs> okay, you talk so proper in the sneak. No, I, I do. Okay, you pronounce everything right. I do. <laughs> Hi, see. How do I be Russian and can speak proper when I'm Russian? <laughs> and when I'm trying to sell articulate, it comes out all crisscross, all types of ways. 
Okay. Yes, the last Family Dollar video I thought I had to, I had it in fast forward, laugh out loud. You were talking so fast. Let me tell you, <laughs> I'm not allowed to record in that bit in that store. So I was trying to sneak because let's be honest. Okay, you didn't miss a word. See, I, I don't know what's wrong with my mouth. <laughs> Look. I can't record in the store, not because I did something wrong. It's because because the Dollar General does not allow me to record. She said she was gonna follow suit, and she wasn't gonna allow me to record either because I guess she said Simon says I don't know. <laughs> she decided she was not gonna allow me to record either, and I was like, really? If they decide to jump off a cliff, you are gonna go right behind them? <laughs> so I be rushing. I be literally be like, you get this. This is the price. You get this. <laughs> Everybody said I talk real fast in my own Dollar General videos. You got to understand, people don't like you to be long-winded. They want you to get straight to the point. And so I try to get straight to the point, and I try to give y'all variety. <laughs> Let me see. I have a screen coupon couponers for years. The TLC show invited me, but local store won't allow filming. Look, that TLC show... A lot of people said that um stores had lost money. Hey, hey, girl, you know, I I'm gonna have to actually get you to pronounce your name for me or something because I be struggling. I the other night I was trying to figure out how to sound this name out, and I was like, she gotta have a nickname. <laughs> I said, You a member, thank you so much. But I said, you have to have a nickname. Hey, Gordis. See, Gordis uh, actually made sure I sounded out. She helped me learn how to say her name. <laughs> yeah, she's doing too much. Look, I be rushing through the store. I be trying. I, I be struggling. Look, you got to understand, people have short attention spans. So to be honest, people don't want to sit down and look at a long video. They don't want you to go in too much detail. Then I'm trying to talk to make sure I say everything, you know, half the time I mess up 10 out of out of hundred words, I think I messed up ninety percent of them, <laughs> and to the point that everybody got. I think one time I said the word, I said "tied simply," and someone commented and said, "What happened to tied simple?" <laughs> I said, "Oh, I thought people wanted me to pronounce it properly." <laughs> like, I'm gonna try. I would try. Okay, sure, Mama. I missed the food there, especially because um. Yesterday, I went to the supermarket, and the price was way too much. Okay, I was trying to do more food deals, but I be stuck with the um Dollar General. Dollar General haven't been blessing us with a whole lot of food stuff. And then some of the stuff um that we have coupons for, my store doesn't sell it. And so that's why I be stuck. But I'm going to come back with some more food deals. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get more food. I try to put some food deals in my scenario, at least food items in my scenario. But I want to do more. Okay. Okay, you was talking so fast in the CVS video, I had to watch it twice. <laughs> because the CVS video was already almost 20 minutes long. <laughs> and you got to understand, people don't like long-winded video. <laughs> and then I was frustrated because I forgot all about that the um this CVS that once midnight hit, the CRTs that I was going to use was going to be gone. And I forgot all about it. So I had to change up my whole scenario because those CRTs was gone. Okay, let me see. Coupon like Ron White comedy says got coupon coupons. You know what? <laughs> okay, I don't understand why they won't let you record. Okay, don't they want people to shop at their store? I don't understand either because I never did nothing wrong in the store. It's just that they just don't want me to record because Dollar General said that they they don't allow me to record, and that's pretty much that's the only reason. They have no other reason. Okay, you saying Tad Simple is just you, and we have grown to love it, short mama. Look, I have my boss. My boss actually thought that it was called Tad Simple until one day. Um, I said it's Tad. I said it's Tad Simply, and then she said it is. <laughs> hey, Alicia. Let me see. Hold on. Good to see. Hold on. Hold on. Cause I got, I got it going. Hold on. Let me see. Good to see you. Love your videos. Always easy to follow and good deals. Thank you for all the work you put into them. Thank you. Okay, let me see. 
Okay, y'all be careful with food at Dollar General. Yes, look at the expiration date. Yes, lots of expired food. Yes, look at the expiration date. Sometimes in my video, okay, did you lose weight? Yes, I did. I did lose weight. Okay, I will listen to you. I don't care how long your videos are. <laughs> I am your number one supporter, your mama. You know what, mama? <laughs> you know what? It takes mama to do this. <laughs> I can't. Let me see. 87 people watching the live stream. Oh, like the video. It's free. Yeah, look, yes, thank you. It's free. <laughs> like the video. Like, give me thumbs up. Give me thumbs up. Okay. Check your store if you're going through remodeling. They are having secret sales. I got a ton of clothes. Um, 10 ringing of 67 cents. I figured out I was 94% off. I'm going to have to check to see how which store is remodeling. Because my store already remodeled. So they already took away all the clothes. I wish I wouldn't have known that. Because <laughs> they took away all the clothes. They don't even have a clothes section no more. Yeah, they don't even have a clothes section no more. Okay. Hey, Tanya. Look, Tanya. I think I said that right. Yes. Look. Let me see. Okay. Now I got to get up and do a breakdown. Look, Miss West, I look forward to seeing all your stuff. Miss West be showing off on the on the IG. Y'all need to have an IG because Miss West be showing off. She be showing off. She be getting everything and she be showing all her little deals. And every time I say I'm not, I'm not going back to that store. Then Miss West posts something. And I said maybe I should go back. And I say, you know what? I, I'm getting tired. I'm getting tired of Miss West always posting these multiple deals. <laughs> Let me see. A lot of family dollars and Dollar General are closed due to no staff. Oh, man. To be honest, people don't want to work. Now, I know a lot of people don't like being political and all this extra stuff, but I'm going to say this. And I know I might get several dislikes and stuff like that. And I, I understand and I'm willing to accept that because my mouth is going to say it. <laughs> so I'm going to accept the repercussions of what I'm about to say. I don't understand when people and this not coupon related i'm about to go ahead and warn you so this your trigger warning if you don't want to dislike me after i say what i say you might want to just go ahead and click off real quick and come back another day <laughs> but i don't understand this whole thing okay even with people in un unemployment i i get it i get it i get it you know some people you know i get it but this is my thing i don't like when people use the pandemic when it benefit them okay and this and this is what i mean in my area we got jobs galore it got to the point that you got fast food restaurants that offering to start you off with 15 16 17 dollars just to get you in the door okay that being said people say oh I don't want to work because I'm afraid of the pandemic. I'm afraid. I don't want to work. I, I'm afraid. I'm afraid. These are the same people that will go to that same fast food restaurant to get, get a burger. The same people that will go to the mall. The same people that's not scared to get their nails done. The same people that's not scared to go to Walmart. <laughs> I mean, not do the pickup order. I'm talking about walking all around in Walmart. <laughs> These are the same people. These and and that was confused me. And a lot of companies and stuff is closing. Okay, I seen Arby's paying 17. Yeah, that's how it is in our, my area. You see a lot. Okay, you say it, girl. Look, I'm sorry, but I say people use that pandemic when it's convenient. Okay, I'm sorry because my thing is if you scared, you scared all the way around. Okay, don't say you scared when someone say work. Okay, when they say go back to work, go back to work. Oh, I'm scared, pandemic. Then all of a sudden you can go to the mall, you can go to the restaurants, you can go to, to you can go all over the world, you can go, but for whatever reason. <laughs> You 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 can't you, you scared to go to work. I'm 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 sorry. I don't understand it. I I don't understand it. I I don't. I understand that people say you getting an extra three hundred dollars. Um, I think it's three hundred. I don't know. Are you getting an extra three hundred dollars with the unemployment and stuff like that? Sorry, not sorry. Work people life continue. You know, people say that you getting an extra eight hundred dollars. I mean, not eight hundred. Oh Lord, Jesus, they were getting an extra eight hundred. Nobody, 
Oh, let me see. Right. That's what I'm saying. But what about the people like me that work in the whole time and can't get no kind of hazard? And that's what I, I said, too. I had got laid off during the pandemic and I felt bad because I'm an assistant manager. I felt bad for my boss because here I'm sitting at home. I'm getting the extra six hundred dollars. She had to work by herself. They didn't give her nothing extra. She she didn't get nothing extra. It was nothing given to her. You got the people that doing the cashiers and the, and all that. They didn't get barely anything extra. Nothing extra. And then you has I feel like and this is me speaking as a democrat, okay? I'm a democrat. And when I say stuff like this, people automatically say, you must be a Republican. No, right is right. Yes, I'm sorry, but right is right. Okay. If you don't use the pandemic <laughs> as an excuse when it comes down to working, but then when you want to do A, B, C, D, E, F, G, oh, all of a sudden, you no longer care about the pandemic. And the pandemic is not even a factor. <laughs> It's not even a fault. Like you don't care when it's something you want to do. Okay. That's what I don't understand. And I have seen, that's why I try not to look at the little news article. I have seen an article. I don't know if it's true or not. I don't know if it's that they was thinking about cutting off the extra 300 early. I don't know if they're going to cut it off early. I don't know. But you looking at it. When I had to apply for because you had to call in the unemployment when you had to call in the unemployment every week they ask you questions like was you available and able to work y yeah you're supposed to say yeah was you actively seeking work okay if y'all say yeah <laughs> y'all lie because half of the people <laughs> that have not been even seeking work because it's no way everywhere you drive you see somebody somebody hiring fast food restaurants is is is, is starting up hot <laughs> let me see i kind of blame the government most of those okay hold on hold on hold on hold on hold on hold on okay she's salary oh lord okay ONG. Okay, I was so scared going to work during the pandemic. Everything closed. No cars on no cars on the street. Real scary. And see, I understand, I understand that. I understand that. But during the pandemic, Miss West, you didn't go nowhere. You you did your job and you went, you didn't go nowhere. Everybody was sitting in the house trying to not to go out, not to go nowhere extra. Now I'm talking about like right now. Right now, stuff is reopening. You got people that's in the mall. People that still saying that they afraid to go back to work, but yet you can you not afraid to go to the mall. Alicia, I know the feeling. We got a jacket, huh? We got a jacket with the company name on it as a pandemic. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That's it. That's all you got? <laughs> a jacket? <laughs> Lord of Jesus. Okay. It's kind of the gov governor fault. Most of those people make more. And, and I agree because a lot of people made more from unemployment. I felt like too much was given at one time. And I feel like, you know, at the long run, this going to hurt us. In the long run, I said, I, I, I don't know, in taxes, we see gas going up, food going to go up, everything going to go up. <laughs> I feel like in the long run, because I feel like a lot of money is, is being used. <laughs> and I'm just waiting to see how this is going to affect us in the long it's always It's already affecting us a little bit. But I'm trying to see how, how long, how, how much this is going to affect us. Okay, I'm a disabled mother with a disabled child. Been inside going out less than 20 times in a 15 month. Just got us both the second vaccine. Both had both had such severe reaction. They had called, oh Lord. I know every I know the second one is is you the first one is not bad, but the second prayer <laughs> the second the second one is yeah okay let me see oh you're talking to her 
Okay, I agree 100% about those people. No worth ethic. Okay, I know uh, a person who started working but was still claiming unemployment too. Oh, Lord Jesus. Okay, they better watch out for that. They won't get you. <laughs> you better watch out for that. Okay, and to be honest, let me tell you, me with the unemployment, that hurt me during tax time. It really did. I know... Uh, they passed the law and everything. I'm supposed to get that money back. Well, some of the money back anyway, whenever they process all of that. <laughs> but the unemployment didn't help me, didn't help me during tax time. It hurt me. <laughs> it hurt me terrible. It made me wonder why. <laughs> why? Okay, let me see. I know. Oh, I already read that one. Okay, you're talking to Nisha. Okay. Okay, stores are packed like. Oh, Jay, thank you. That's my argument. Like a lot of people, I had a girl that said that she ain't going back to work. And she ain't going back to work until this extra three hundred dollars is over and done with. Because she gonna get as much as she can get because she's still worried about her life. Then she went to Walmart, and Walmart is as packed as packed can be. And I'm like, you ain't worried about being in Walmart. You're not. Walmart don't scare you. All these people, half of them don't have masks on. That don't scare you. Girl, I mean, you can't have from germs. Oh, now you can't have from germs. Oh, okay. Okay. That's nice. <laughs> that is so nice. Okay, totally agree. It's not even about um political um uh, politics. I'm sorry. It's not even about politics uh, anymore. It's about what's right. Thank you. And that's what I was trying to say. It's not about politics, it's about what's right what's right in general come on now i said people is using the pandemic if you not afraid to get your nails done i don't understand how you can use the pandemic as an excuse not to go to work and that's just my opinion okay let me see okay i know i know those same people collecting unemployment and working all the books yes because a lot of people, a lot of people, they they are collecting, they still collecting, they trying to still want to get the extra three hundred. But I did read an article that uh, I don't know what state it was, but they talking about um uh, ending the extra three hundred. I guess it's not supposed to end till September, if I'm not mistaken. Don't get me to laugh, cause I try not to look at anything that gonna disturb my spirit. <laughs> I think it was supposed to end in September, if I'm not mistaken. But a lot of states are deciding to end it early. And I seen an article that somebody had posted and they were outraged about it. Then this is another thing. That, like I said, this is all my opinions. We have you don't have to agree with my opinions, okay? Okay, let me just express that. You don't have to agree with my opinions. I understand, okay. Hold on, let me read several things real quick. Okay, I'm in the medical field, work with COVID patient, wish I had received a $300 bonus. You know what? And this is sad. I feel like all the nurses should have got more, should have got an extra $1,000 in their paycheck. Every paycheck, they should at least got an extra $1,000. Really during the pandemic, I felt like every nurse should have got an extra 1000 in their paycheck, every paycheck. I'm talking about every paycheck. That's how I felt, at least. And that and that's how I felt. Because the nurses was going through it. The nurses, the nurses was going through it. The um post office, the um, you know, mail, the um post office people, they were going through it. You had the the um clerks and cashiers at grocery stores uh were going through it i felt like all, all of them should have got an extra pay because it seems like it wasn't fair. it didn't motivate people to want to work because they look at they get to sit down they get to be in the house they get to be safe they don't have to risk their life and here they get an extra six hundred dollars and here i'm risking my life and i'm going to work and i'm trying to maintain and what i'm getting what what am i getting who looking out for us we the one actually risking our life and that's how you know i understand that's how i felt i felt like they should have gave the essential workers more that something more that's how i felt okay hold on let me see it's like living on house arrest without committing a crime that is so true <laughs> you put that so well <laughs> you put 
that so well. So mama, did it put you in another tax bracket? Yes, it did. <laughs> yes, it did. It really, it hurt me. <laughs> it hurt. <laughs> okay, remote school, remote doctors, remote therapy. <laughs> I, I, okay, I've been a secretary. Look, let me tell you something. I never, you know, I felt like when school actually opened, my kids' teachers, I need to get them. If they ask for 10,000 Lysol wipes, they ask for Kleenex, I'm going to be right there with a whole box. I'm going to say, look, let me give you a Starbucks gift card. I, I appreciate you, teacher. I appreciate. I, 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 I appreciate. I did not know how hard your job was until I had to deal with my own kids and try to teach them. <laughs> I appreciate you. <laughs> and I want you to know this. What you need? I got Lysol. <laughs> I got I got this effect spray. <laughs> I got Kleenex. You, you, whatever you need. I, I have it. Okay. I'm gonna get you, I'm gonna give you a Starbucks gift card. Let me go get you that. Coffee on me. <laughs> you do Dunkin's Donut. Let me go get you that gift card. Coffee gonna be on me. I never knew how hard <laughs> the job was. <laughs> That's how I feel right now. That that's how I feel. Okay, let me read it back. Let me see. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, I missed a lot. Everybody, it went up real quick. Okay, right here. Especially employees not wearing wearing masks. I'm like, what? Okay, I've been to Walmart in year and a half. Okay, you haven't been to Walmart in a year and a half. Oh Lord, I know. I had to run in there and look. I I I was so mad because I I do not like on um, Walmart at all. Okay. Be sure to hit the thumbs up like button. 104 watch it. Oh, thank you. Give me the thumbs up. Thank you, Jay. Okay. Florida in the extra 300 this week. Oh, oh my Lord. I guess they say everybody going to the beaches. You ain't going to the beaches with that $300. <laughs> Let me start joking before people get mad. <laughs> like you ain't going to celebrate with that. <laughs> Let me see. I still wear a mask in Walmart. People are gross. Yes, they are. Okay. But it's been nice being able to use my own discretion when to use it and when not to. Yes, it is. It is. Okay. Hey, Jason, you was the first one here. Then you must have dealt. <laughs> Let me see. Them traveling nurses got super paid, but the nurses that actually assigned to a hospital got regular pay. See, that was wrong. That was wrong. I don't like that. That was wrong. Okay. Those who supposed to be hazard paid, where where that? Huh? Where that? Okay. So they did they get it or they didn't? Or they didn't get the hazard pay? Okay. I work for it. Okay, I work for the biggest needle company we own. Oh, Lord. Okay. Hey, everybody. Okay, that's Jason again. Okay, hold on. See, this thing keep popping. Going all the way back up, and I miss it. I'm missing people. Hold on. Give me a second. Okay. Yes, it's supposed to end in September, but it's 12 or more states that's going to end them at the end of June and July. Oh, See, so the article was right that I read. Okay, okay. I I work for the biggest company, and we got only eight hours of vacation, huh? And a handshake. What? <laughs> oh, oh, what? You know what? Eight hours. Okay, you know what? They disturb my spirit. Uh, uh. Okay, they 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 woo. Oh, you know what? I got hot for you. Here I got, I got at least three weeks of vacation, three or four weeks of vacation, and they only gonna give you eight hours. You know what? Okay. Hello, short mama, and everyone in the chat room. I hope everyone uh, is having a blessed, a beautiful, blessed day. Hey, Miss Tina. Okay, I figured that extra unemployment was hurting some people. Look. I think the whole issue was the fact that they feel like people is not actually looking for a job. Like they're not trying to go back to work. And I think that's what the issue is, is I think, because I think that you look at it, all the hiring signs and you people is starting folks off with a whole lot of money. Like they're not trying to do just minimum wage. They trying to get you in there and people still not trying to go, go to work. And I think they say, look, you're supposed to at least be looking for a job. <laughs> 
And then like um one person said, you got store like Dollar Generals and Family Dollar shutting down because they don't have no staff. Let me see. Hey everyone, miss your lab. Yes, good. Look, I said I was gonna be up here for 30 minutes and y'all let me talk for for 44 minutes. <laughs> Not to mention the emotional toll on essential workers. Yes, offer free counseling. I agree. Okay. Them teacher, all right. <laughs> they get holidays and weekends off from the kids, and they've been out for for the three I mean, for three last year. Look, I never knew how much I pre I'm gonna show that teacher I appreciate them. Cause when I say I graduated in 06. And when I look at half of the kids, what they doing now, I was like this. Let me get Google. Google, help me. <laughs> Google. Google. What the what? <laughs> Google. <laughs> I was pillowful. <laughs> I was pillowful. Show mama, I give you tips with taxes. Um, cousins and uncle both do it for a living. My aunt. Let me see. My aunt were at the biggest law firm in Orlando. Oh, okay. I need all the tips I could get because that unemployment hurt me. <laughs> I'm waiting for them to give me whatever I'm supposed to get back. <laughs> let me see. Uh, our, let me see. Our school are done for the summer now, but it was like every two weeks or so they go in. Then someone tested positive in the district. Oh, and they were closed for two weeks. Oh man, that is sad. Okay, so thankful. Let me see. So thankful. My mom has run errands, performance, grocery store, medical supplies, etc. She has been my blessing from the beginning. I know that's right. You cherish your mama now. I'm trying to tell you. I cherish your mama. Okay. At my own um, granddaughter's school, did not close when someone said, Wait a minute, they didn't close? Let me make sure I read that right. Okay. At my granddaughter's school, school did not close when someone tested positive. So they continue going? Did they at least give you a letter or something so you could decide if you want to not have your kids in school? Like, that's crazy. Okay. That's what we got, we got for working the pandemic. You know what? And that's jacked up. During the middle of the lockdown, it was non-essential and essential. So Walmart and big companies were allowed to sell non-essential items, but small businesses wasn't. Mm. I know I had to bring I had to bring Lysol, Clorox wipes. I had to bring all of that to my job because my um it was none available and my store they didn't have they had their own warehouse that they order from they didn't have nothing they gave us this um i don't know what it was but it was some kind of spray and the spray when you spray to clean the the office it, it have you dizzy so i didn't know what was it i didn't trust it i didn't know what kind of chemicals that was in it <laughs> but it literally would have you dizzy and if it touched your skin it would break your whole skin off your skin will be inflamed I said, I don't know. They're trying to get us. They're trying to kill us. <laughs> I brought that Clorox and stuff from home. I said, I'm not using that. I don't know what they gave us, but no, not today. Okay. COVID has traumatized me. I don't think I'm ever taking off my mat. Look, I said the same thing. I said the same thing. I said, I think I'm traumatized. Okay. Let's be honest. If I'm getting 600 dropped in my account every week, Who's looking for a job? I don't get any unemployment for the record. That's what I'm saying. That's what I said. That's why I was saying nobody is looking for a job because they feel like you will get more. Like, let me tell you how bad it was. When my boss, when the district manager called me for me to come back to work and I was getting that extra $600, he called me and said, hey, do you want to come back to work? I said, sure. He said, you serious? <laughs> That's exactly what he said. He said, you serious? <laughs> you actually going to come back? <laughs> That's because it's like unheard of. $600. You had people that were bringing in like $1,000 a week. And then you expect for them to go back to work. I could chill. Sit, sit at home, watch Netflix. You know, 
we don't have an Uber Eats and all that around here. <laughs> I live in the country, but <laughs> they can do some pickup order, order out, <laughs> maybe Domino's or Pizza Hut. They can order pizza <laughs> and chill and make and get this type of money every week. Now this is the now this is the next thing that I'm about to say that confused me with this. The people that was getting unemployment, okay. And the people that was getting that extra six hundred dollars, explain to me how come they was not able to pay their bills. Because now I agree, if it, if someone did not get unemployment and they wasn't getting the extra six hundred and they wasn't working, I'm not talking. I'm not talking to those people because they their circumstances is different. Their situation is different. But I'm talking about the people that got the stimulus check. Turn around, got unemployment. Turn around and got you know all the stimulus check. Turn around, got unemployment. The extra six hundred dollars and all that. I don't understand how come you you wasn't able to pay you. I have a friend that's a landlord, and she made the comment that she didn't get she haven't got no no rent money for a year, and she know that this person had was on unemployment received the extra 600 got the stimulus checks but just because it i guess it's a, a law or something saying that you know they didn't have to pay the rent or it was some kind of you know y'all y'all correct me if i'm wrong i don't know but i guess it was something that was preventing her to be able to um evict her and i don't understand why you couldn't pay I just don't because the first thing everybody did she said to her was it's a pandemic and I wasn't working. But you were getting an extra six hundred dollars and now you're getting an extra three hundred dollars and you got all those stimulus checks. So I don't get why you were actually getting paid more than if you was working. So I don't get it. I don't get it. I just don't get it. Let me see. At my school, if one a person hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. Hold on. Okay, if if they hold on, I'm I missed a whole lot of messages. Okay, at my school, hold on, at my school, if one person call in sick, all the all the students exposed in all seven classes had to quarantine, and the teacher had to too. If they were not vaccinated, okay, a lot of people just stop going. Oh Lord, okay. You talk about Tina. Okay. Yeah, we have at Arby's a Taco Bell. They can't stay open for more than a few weeks at a time because a uh, few employees get burned out and quit. The restaurant's been packed. Okay. Love your personality. You make me smile when you let. Thank you. Okay. Dizzy. No, ma'am. I'm trying to tell. I don't know what they, what they gave us to clean that store with, but it made us dizzy. Okay. If they was in the same class, they would tell you, but if not in the same class, no letter or nothing. Uh Uh-uh. That's not right. That's not right. Okay. What I don't understand is that they shut down a small business, which has less people in a day then Walmart does. How is that COVID safe? I don't understand. You made a good point. That that is a good point. Let me see. Okay, you you said the same thing. Give the employee employee people on um, three hundred extra a week. Watch how many people go back to work. Look, they had said. I think somebody said that they were trying to um do pass something get back to work so if they get back to work they get a one-time payment of 1500 but they had to stay employed for three months or something i don't know how that worked but yeah i don't understand why people won't work if you don't work you won't eat i don't know i think they got a little spoiled <laughs> i think people got a little spoiled okay we didn't stop working we didn't stop working Oh, your job didn't stop working? Okay, I was scared to eat, carry out during the lockdown. I don't know if they are sick back there. Look, I didn't eat no carry out during the, um, I didn't eat no carry out. I cook all my own food. I was scared too. And then I said half of those kids was teenagers and they don't care. <laughs> okay, I'm a teacher and I don't get 
Um, I don't get the summer off. I've been working in person since last June. We got one month of hazard pay. Teachers are needed and un underappreciated. I agree. I'm look. If I had the money, I would get. I would give you an extra bonus, girl. If I had the money, I'm telling you, I never knew how much I appreciate teachers until I had to try to teach my kids. <laughs> Let me see. Thank you. Just look at Insta. I mean, at Instagram deals. Okay. Yep. Event. Event. Yes. I feel like she should be a vet. I'm sorry. I know some people say you're not showing no sympathy, but if you got all that money, come on now. Come on. Okay. You're on. Um, you're correct. They couldn't evict people, which is a shame. Yeah. And my thing is, some people use that money that they, you know, for their rental property. For their income for to pay their bills. So who looking out for them? Who looking out for the landlords? I'm just wondering. I don't know. Maybe they got a program. I don't know. I, I didn't I didn't look that far. <laughs> so maybe y'all will say, short mama, you talk about stuff you don't know. They do have a program for the landlords. I don't know. Because I wonder who who is looking out for the landlords. <laughs> I agree. Hold on. I don't know. So y'all correct me if I'm wrong. Okay, let me see. Okay, you're talking to her. Okay, they got okay, they got to know this unemployment thing is going to end soon. I don't think they think so because they I heard somebody saying that they um trying to get a fourth stimulus check. So I don't know. Okay, so I guess they're trying to come up with some more stuff. I don't know. I try not to look at because I don't want to get depressed. Okay, Georgia says there's like three hundred thousand plus jobs. That's why they cut in, they cut the check. Oh Lord, they said y'all gonna work somewhere. We tired of y'all. <laughs> Let me start joking about this. Okay. I had to work nonstop from the beginning. Never stop. I need a break. I know that's right. Girl, we your vacation. <laughs> you need to take a vacation. The teachers here been off here for over a year. They've been off for a year and a half, and they still arguing not to come back. Oh, Lord. They haven't came back. Are they doing virtual? Or they just said, we're not even teaching the kids. <laughs> what what they doing? <laughs> Okay, the whole thing at Walmart doesn't make sense. Shut down the extra door and make people stay in like, I mean, in light to get in. Oh, stay in line to get in. They was doing that at the beginning, but they stopped. Hold on. Hold on. There we go. Let me see. I'm trying to see the comment. They won't let me see it. Okay, they, they won't let me see it. Hold on. Sorry. Hold on. Trying to see the comment. Okay. Uh, let me see. They was in Vegas. I've been, I seen them bones. They just want something for free. Uh -uh -uh. Okay, let me see. Because this thing keep on um, pop going all the way up. Hold on, I'm trying to, okay. I work with the state and no one wants to work, especially since they are exempt from having to do anything. You know what? My job, in my area, everywhere hiring. Everywhere is hiring. I said, I would think about doing a part-time gig or something. I said, everywhere is hiring over here. Okay. They evict things was, the evict thing was BS. I can say that. I, I know what it means, but I can say the letters. <laughs> the landlord still had to pay and wouldn't waive anything. Oh, so some people still had to pay. Oh, okay. So it was up to the landlord or... How did that work? I don't know. How did that work? Because um, the way she talked, she talked like she couldn't evict her. Okay. The girl downstairs is four months behind in her rent, and my landlord can't do anything about it. Oh, my Lord. See, that's wrong. That's wrong because my thing is, I know you had got some money. Come on now. Okay, unless you can show proof that you didn't get no stimulus, you didn't get no unemployment, you didn't get nothing. Then that's a different story. Okay, but come on now. Okay, it sent you a non essential worker. I appreciate you working through the pandemic. I know that's right. I appreciate y'all too. I worked two jobs before and still working both. So there's no excuses. Beautiful Jess, I know that's right. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, okay, they just doing virtual. Now, my school is, um, they allowing the kids to go to school. Like right now, my daughter, she want to graduate early. So she going to, she going to, um, summer school. So they allowing the kids to go to summer school is Monday through Thursday. And she actually get to go inside the school. 
And so they trying to, cause they trying to um see how that work because they want the kids to be back in school starting next year because it was hard for a whole lot of kids to do virtual. I, I guess they said these mothers and and parents are dumb. <laughs> We were struggling. We were struggling. I know I was struggling with half of my kids' work. <laughs> I was struggling. <laughs> okay. Like my father and mother told me, if you don't work, you don't eat. That's what my mom said. Just running game when they go run game as long as they can. Oh, let me see. Girl, they not working. They about to live off um, that loan money they got. Let me tell you something. I don't care what nobody say. All this money, all these stimulus, all this stuff that we got, we're going to have to pay it back somehow. Somehow. We're going to pay it back. If it's the increase in gas or increase in food or increase in something, we they we going to find a way to pay. They're going to find a way for us to pay it back. <laughs> Let me see. In Texas, the governor stopped the unemployed for COVID. Oh, okay. See? Okay. Got to go. Oh, you have a great weekend. Oh, see you, Nellie. Let me see. Show mama no, I was saying that them stopping. Hold on, hold on. Let me see. That them stopping the eviction wasn't right because the landlord still had to pay their mortgage. Oh, that's okay. Good. You were basically agreeing with me. Okay, yes, I agree. Because I said you don't know what bills they had to pay. So was it a, a program or something for the landlords or something? Because they still had to pay their bills. Let me see. Okay, that's great. She is smart to get in and get out. Who get in and got out? Let me see. I have a cleaning business I kept working on, okay? All my kids had to work through the whole pandemic, and my daughter-in-law was pregnant. Look at that now. And see, your daughter-in-law, she's a good woman. Because I think just the fact that you... um. That she's pregnant, I don't think I would have risked that. I would have been in the house. I don't mean no harm. I would have been afraid. I would have been sitting in the house. I probably would have went back to work after my six week after my baby was born. But I think I would have been in the house. Okay, increase toilet paper. <laughs> increase toilet paper. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I see a virtual hug. Oh, thank you. But yeah, look, we got all off the coupon and topic. <laughs> We got all off the couponing topic, but yeah, I mean, I just had little opinions. I just don't understand, but I want to see how everything goes, how how the world end up changing. <laughs> People said that we need a, a fourth stimulus check. I don't know if we actually need that or not, <laughs> because a lot of jobs out here. Okay, restaurant has already increased. Yes, restaurant prices look. You you better get that five dollar menu because now a regular small combo will be almost ten dollars. You be like, Lord Jesus. <laughs> Let me see. I agree. At the end of the year, they are going to get a shop when they have to pay pay it back or won't get a refund for the next few years. I agree. The same thing I feel now. Like I said, this is my opinion. I'm not one hundred percent sure. I said with the child tax credit, I said, I think a lot of people that get those big tax refunds, like around here, we have people that get big tax returns, like $7,000. Okay. I feel like they're going to be cut. They're going to be cut because for what I think I understand that the money that you're going to be getting every month for the child, that means that you already got your, your credit. That's your credit. So when it comes down to filing your taxes, you're only going to get half of that. You're not going to get that full credit. You know how people get that big tax return? You're not going to get that for taking no kids because you already got it when they were paying you those monthly payments. I said a lot of people going to be upset at the end when it's time to file the tax and they're going to be thinking they're going to get that 7000 and then it'll be cut in half. <laughs> That's what I think. I think I, I think okay. Yes, you are correct. Okay, thank you. Because I be trying to understand all these big words they be using, they be throwing at me, and I be trying to understand them. <laughs> My boyfriend told me I had too much toilet paper, and then he said he was grateful that I coupon. Look, that's how my fiance was. He was like, I'm so happy you coupon. Cause he said people is going crazy over the toilet paper. 
Okay. I think COVID will increase, especially um, with the mass mandate ending. Everybody is going to be um, vaccinated. I hope I hope everything go back to normal, but I I think is is still going to be some because they had, did a poll saying that people is not using hand sanitizer as much as at first. People ain't wiping that wiping things down like they was at first. So I hope everybody continue being clean, continue using your hands and washing your hands, wiping stuff down. I hope everybody continue doing it. There's a lot of life salt and Clorox in the store now. I need people to be stocking up on it. Just still buying it. <laughs> go back. Okay, yes, I've been telling them, why would you get that credit? We are already halfway um, through the year. Come on now. See, yes, because I said a lot of people are going to be hurt when it comes time to file their taxes. Okay, we're going to have to get um, used to a new normal. I agree. COVID is, uh, isn't everywhere over y'all. Huh? COVID isn't anywhere near near over okay COVID isn't anywhere near over y'all it's still um uh, mutate mute you know what i know we're saying we we will have another uh major problem if we get the one from india oh lord i i'm gonna continue wiping stuff down praying wearing my mask okay okay it was a joke everybody gonna be called um uh, vaccinated you know what i i'm just gonna pray wipe everything down try to stay clean and keep my hand sanitizer my distance i still spray the nozzle on the gas pump when i gotta pump gas i still spray that way on um, lights off yes i do yes i do i, I still do it <laughs> i said that's all we can do these days that's all we can do okay yes a couple had a new strain of covid oh are here in the U.S. Lord of Jesus. See, it, it they in the, at least put them in the hospital. If they in the hospital, Lord of Jesus. Okay, I'm keeping my mask and germans. I know that's right. I know that's right. Okay, that's right, short mama. You get the money every month starting in July, and at the end of the year, you only get in the first half. See. A lot of people going to be hurt when they think they're going to get that big tax return and come to find out. No, you're not. The devil is like, you ain't going to get that big tax return. Mm -mm. They're going to find out. They're going to find out. Let me see. Okay. They give landlord money, but everyone is being greedy. Oh, they do get landlords money. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. By winter, we will be locked down again. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Okay, it's good. One gallon, or one gallon, one gallon, one gallon concentrate made 30 gallon kill. Oh, okay. What? I want to Google that. <laughs> Let me see. I know a family that is currently held COVID, young and old, and the grandma been in the hospital for a month from ages 12 to, hold on, 12 to 65. Oh, man. Hey y'all. Okay. No, you ain't. Oh, uh, no, you ain't. Okay. Okay. Yes, I'll okay. I was germaphobe before the pandemic and still one. I know that's right. Okay. Local store has hand when you got hands head sanitizer, eight for a dollar. I brought them out. I know that's right. Go ahead and get them while the while the getting is good. Right now, whenever I see stuff like that on sale, I go ahead and grab it. Okay, I mean, prices are going up, so keep on couponing, penny shopping, etc. I'm doing Dollar General, Walgreens, CVS, and rebates. We going, we got it. Yes, be prepared and also save some money. Save, you know, put yourself on a budget. I put myself on a nice budget. I save. I matter of fact, I got to post my state opera video, so I'm going to post that when I get off of here because I forgot the um roll for. I forgot to roll for say Apple on the 4th of June. So I rolled for the 4th and I rolled for the 18th. So yeah, I'm trying to tell you, say. Okay, hold on. Okay, where are you located? I'm in Virginia. Okay. What are we talking about? We were talking about a whole lot of stuff. We talk about a little bit of Dollar General. We're talking about the 
pandemic. We're talking about COVID. We're talking about unemployment. <laughs> we're, talking about, we're talking about a lot of stuff. <laughs> a lot of stuff. Most likely, this going to be demonetized because <laughs> that's what they do when I mention COVID and all that stuff. They, they demonetize me. <laughs> Let me see. No one wearing masks anymore. I'm not going to lie. I don't wear masks. Look, if you feel confident and you feel safe, at the end of the day, you grown. So, I mean, if you're right. If that's what you, if you feel okay. Let me see. Let me see. I need to go. Thanks for the chat. Oh, see you, uh, Miss Sassy Mama. Okay. Hey, it's your mama. Love your deals and China. God bless you and your family. Thank you for all you do. Oh, thank you. And you're welcome. Okay. Let me see. When it is, okay. When are we will be locked down again? Watch. A lot of people saying that. Let me see. Oh, um, your mama. Okay. Going to key stock stocking and say, oh, you talking about her. Okay. I agree. Okay. I got everybody comment. Hold on. Just got one. Okay. Okay, they're not going to have to pay to pay the money back. They get in the extra money from the tax credit because Joe Biden changed the income guidelines so they qualify for the money. Oh, see, I, I don't even look at all of that. I don't. <laughs> I don't even look. Let me tell you something. I try not to get be depressed. And all that politics stuff make you depressed. <laughs> I try not to look at it. Let me see. Yes, stock up and be safe. I know that's right. Um, let me see. Lock down again. And look, I hope not, but Lord Jesus. Okay, you still you still going to do the dove scenario for Dollar General? Yes, I already went over um that. So you had to rewind back, and I already went over that one, the dove deal. I just that I'm not going to even incorporate the two off of um, eight because it's not showing up. But I did show two dove deals that I'm planning on doing. Okay, let me see. My babies are all grown, but if you or someone you know is getting that child credit, you, yes, they need to put it in a savings and try not, yes, that's what I say, save, save. Okay, I don't, okay, I don't mean walk to the store, huh, to the store and back and you still, oh, you walk to the store and back and you <laughs> still, Look, and I supposed to only been on for 30 minutes. See how y'all do me? Okay, I'm with you. Don't watch the news anymore. It's too much bad news. You be having a good day, and then you look at the news, and you just get depressed. <laughs> and then you be like, I was having a good day. Okay, let's see. Let's just pray no lockdown. I know that's right. I will stock up on whites to clean it. Yes, just to have that. Yes, that's what I'm saying. Stock up. Like, I think on Dollar General app, they have a lifestyle coupon up there. Clip that coupon. If you could fit it in a five off of 25, go ahead and be stocked up because you never know what can happen. So just be stocked up. Hey, Mississippi girl, like, <laughs> yeah, so just be stocked up. So I'm going to go ahead and get off. Y'all got me because, see, I'm supposed to be I'm supposed to be out. I said I was going to only be up here for 30 minutes and I'm up here for an hour and 12 minutes. <laughs> See how y'all get me, but I love y'all though. I love you. <laughs> so anyway, I think I can keep this live. It's gonna be demonetized because we talked about COVID and we talked about stuff like that. So it's gonna most likely be demonetized. Okay. So anyway, also gonna have to. Okay. Oh, sorry. I got. I got to look back. Okay. I've been selling stuff. Girl, you better make that money. That's what I'm talking about, Miss Brooks. Make that money. <laughs> okay. We were enjoying our time. I know that's right. So I'm going to go ahead and give myself a plug. Y'all know I always got to promote my little self. If y'all interested in being a support to my channel or if you need extra help with couponing and stuff like that, I'm offering the membership. It's $1.99 or $2.99 a month. But if you don't want the membership, you don't have to get it. You'll still be able to watch the videos. Um, the link will be in the description box. Um, with the membership, I will um, answer all your questions and all of that. And you will have my number just in case you happen to be in the store or you happen to um, want some help or help with a transaction or something like that. You can call me. Okay. 
But like I said, you do not have to get the membership. You still be able to watch the videos. I got to constantly say that because I guess some people think that they're going to click on my video and they're going to say, please pay. No, it's not going to do that. <laughs> okay. It's not going to do that. You'll be all right. Okay. So if you're interested in joining the membership, link will be below right now. Everybody have membership perks. If you happen to ask me a question in one of my videos, I got back to you or you can email me and I will get back to you. But after June, you know, all those extra perks will be only exclusive to members. So, but anyway, thank you. Thank you for being here with me. Oh, look, Miss Forbes, where was you at, girl? <laughs> Have a good night. Have a good night. Miss Forbes, did you just pop in? 